Hi everyone, I am going to show you something really neat that you can do as far as making your own images uh, with Symbol Sticks Prime that you can use on your Google Slides if you want to build um, any kind of background or if you're using a virtual classroom that you want to make. Um, all right, so let's get started. I have my Symbol Sticks Prime account open here and I have my board wizard open. Uh, all right, so let's go to symbols and images. I have typed teddy bear in here. We're gonna put this image in, and then I'm gonna use my snipping tool. You can see I already did it, but let's start fresh. New image, and I'm gonna take my tool just ahead of this teddy bear. You know, I don't like the way that looks. I'm gonna go to new. Oh, let's see, let's redo this. Let's get rid of that that outline. We'll go to new and we are going to put that cursor just inside the box because we don't want to get the outline of the box and we'll go right around the teddy bear. All right now we're going to control C or copy. We're not saving this image we're just going to copy it and then we are going to go to a program. Uh, it's called it's remove.bg. It's a website that my very good friend Rebecca told me about. I could not do this without her. And we are just simply going to paste, not print, paste. We are going to paste the image here. And bam, just like that, there it is. It is an image without the white background. and then paste it here. If I move that, you can see there is no white background. Now, if I had come over here and copied that, if I just had this and copied this image and put it in my Google Classroom or put it in my Google Slide here, you'll see it has the white background. That's not helpful if you're adding images that you want to be a PNG or like a clip art. So for uh, just to show you what I'm, what I'm talking about here, let's go ahead and change the background here. And I have classroom background clip art. And let's put this in. And you set your teddy bear in there. There you go. Just like that. So you can do that with any of your symbol sticks uh, prime images. Again, you just go to your symbol sticks, search whatever image you want, and you do a snip of the image like that. Copy it. Go to remove.bg. And you're going to paste it. And then when you see it there with the little squares in the back, you know that you can either you can click to download it. And drag and drop that way as well. And you can you can use this for all kinds of things. So that's a real quick tool to make your own PNGs. And you can do that with any image you want, um, personal images, uh, but it's really helpful when you're using Symbol Sticks Prime. All right, I hope you found this helpful.